Hey, what's going on, everyone? Today's December the 4th, 2021. We're going to talk about Kadena today. You guys can see the price has crashed. You guys are going to see a whole lot of videos on YouTube talking about this cryptocurrency is on sale, it's on discount. You need to come in and swoop as much as you can because the price is cheaper than what it was a couple of days ago well welcome to hfn also known as hf news i will give you all my updated price prediction for the market and kadana because if the market really is cheap then that should mean that the price has stopped from going lower in price because if not then the price is expected to get a lot cheaper and you will want to wait and then come in and purchase more of this cryptocurrency so keep it locked in here hit the like button should also subscribe here to the channel because this is what i do i make sure that we per prime and predict where prices is going to go so that we can get in a position and win because there's definitely some things i need to tell you all today into the market for Cadena. so before I get started, let's go ahead and talk about my last video that I did. It was only a couple of days ago, December the 1st, 2021. We was looking for the price and Kadena to go up, and it has. It did, but it wasn't long-lasting. The price only went up minor, maybe towards $18, and since then, the price has gone back down. Now, listen, before you leave... After you watch this video, go back and listen to what I said on my previous video about Kadena, about if something was to occur, that it won't be a good thing, that we won't be expecting the price to go up. You guys can see where those two lines intersect tells us massively that we're not looking for the price in Kadena to go up. We have broken the trend. That is the breaking news that has occurred today, even on yesterday's trading day. That many people are going to try to get you to think that the price is going to go up because the price is a lot cheaper than what it was two, three days ago. That is not the case. The price charts don't lie. You have to learn how to trust what price is showing you on the price chart. So let me go ahead and get rid of my last price. But if you guys didn't grab some of that profitability following our price prediction on the 1st of December, then you guys are definitely in a downward position. You're down 22 and a half percent rather than you grabbing six and a quarter right before the price and Kadena went down. It goes that way. You Sometimes you got to react real quick into the market and don't try to hold on to these cryptocurrencies for the long term because so many people want you to do it. They continue to tell you all to hold to these cryptocurrencies for 5, 10, 15, 13,000 years with the premise of seeing this price go up massively. Now, who am I to say that that's not going to happen? It could happen, no doubt, especially with these promising cryptocurrencies. Is Kadena part of that? Maybe, maybe not. But for us, we simply worry about the price and where we are at today so that we can be in position and win. So let me get rid of this, okay? So now, already, I'm telling you off the rip, I'm not looking for the price in Kadena to go up because of what happened on December the 3rd. We broke the trend. I have identified back on December the 1st. You guys can go back and listen and see it. I told you, as long as the price in container was able to hold $15, $16 at support, and then no lower than us testing this ascending line, then yeah, we're going to look for the price to continue to go up. But the decision has been made. I'm not here to persuade you. You guys can literally see it for yourself. The decision has been made. We have broken the trend in Kadena. The market trend, which started back in October, has been broken. So now the question is, how low are we going to go in price, right? Well, we already, found, we already found one part. The market came in Kandana and held support here. All right, that's it. We've created an initial point to where we are noticing where the buyers are at right now in Kandana, okay? Now, literally, where I told you on December the 1st was support, it is now going to be restriction. So let's create that. 16 dollars. Now, you guys can see it. I'm not looking for the ascending line to maintain itself. I'm looking for price in Kandana to start a consolidation or trading range, if anything, right? Because if we're not going to hold a trading channel into the market in Kandana, then that simply means that we're going to continue to go lower in price. Things has changed. The environment for Kandana has changed. We are no longer seeing price in a upward momentum. The price has confirmed that we have started a downward trend. Okay. So now you guys can see from here, this is where the decision will be made as to whether or not we're going to continue to go down in price or will we elevate ourselves and maintain that upward progression of us going higher in price. 
right there. This is the crossroads. So as we continue to approach price progression throughout the month of December, keep your eyes open on that crossroads where those two lines cross. That is where the decision is going to be made, because if we get rejected there, then we're going to go lower. If price breaks upward of that crossroads, then we're going to go higher. It's just that simple. So right now, you guys can see that we are seeing increased volume. We are noticing that the very wide spread coming in today into the market in Kadena. And you guys can see it right here. So look at this from a weekly perspective. We broke the trend. Three day time frame. Take a look. So if anyone tries to persuade you to come in and buy the market today, they don't understand the market. This is not the time to come in and buy Cadena when we don't know how low price is going to go. Days like today tells you that the market has completely flipped. When you see a very wide spread on any trading day, it tells you that something has changed. The momentum into the market has changed for that particular project or cryptocurrency. So I'm here to tell you now, this is not the time. We need to sit back and wait. Or you could buy a small snippet of this currency. It's nothing wrong with that. But let's not go all in, right? Let's not go all in because this has not been determined that $10 is support right now. Here it is. So currently, can we see price go up? Of course, right? I already told you that $16 is where the restriction point is going to be into the market in Kadena. That's where it's at. So yeah, we can see price go up, but as we do, pay attention to see if the sellers are still present at $16 because that's where they'll let us know, hey, price is going to continue to fall in Kadena. Look at that. So what do you all think? Yeah, I know many of you think just because the price is a lot cheaper than what it was back in November time frame that you need to come in and scoop up everything into the market. That's what they want you to do. You guys got to understand that is what they want you to do. They want you to come in and scoop up these prices, even though you guys can literally tell that there was nothing but weakness here on these two day price bars right here. So they were selling the whole time into the market whoever had the bag in Kadena was selling the market and now that market folded finally broke because there wasn't no buying coming in around $16 so now they found buyers because people are rushing in thinking that Kadena is a massive buy now because it's a lot cheaper than what it was a couple of days ago now they're still selling into the market so this is it yeah we can see the price come up to around $14.75 cool like if we were to see that let me show you how much profitability that would be in this space 1475 that's around 11 almost 12 percent movement to the upside in price for Kadena, right right there now when you see situations like this you just need to kick back and relax. Like if you're not into the market right now in Kadena, yeah, you need to kick back and relax and, and just wait till the market gives us more information into determining whether or not we're going to continue to go lower or are we going to resume to higher prices? Because off the rip, by us moving down so fast, I would expect the market to try to come back up, right? And as we see this process ongoing right now today, we need to see where the sellers are at. Now, I'm looking around here, $14.75 to $16. And once that price approaches those price levels, pay attention to see if the selling comes in again. Because if so, we're going to go lower in price. Simple, right? So I'm not going to do a price predicts into the market in Kadena. I just wanted to show you what my expectations will be now going forward, considering that we have seen this massive move to the downside in Kadena. The market environment has changed. I want to come in and speak to you all about it. And let me try to give you all the play as to what I'm expecting in terms of my prediction. I'm not going to put one on the chart though. Okay. Now, first 
I'm looking for price to try to inch up higher, not exceedingly higher, not massively bullish. I'm looking for the spot to where the sellers are at. Now, my first idea is around $14.25 to 75 cents. That's the first spot. But the biggest deciding factor is going to occur right here. Okay. So I'm going to keep the line here. I'm going to keep the arrow right there because I want everyone to see this as we approach the market in Cadena to $16. That is where the trend is. And you guys can see that as we've been trending down, the market in Cadena has broken away from this downward trend, right? So yeah, you would naturally expect us to try to come back at and test it and then come back down. That's what I'm expecting. That is my prediction. I'm not gonna put one on the chart yet though, because I wanna see how strong the market's gonna to be today, ending out into tomorrow's trading day, okay? So let me hold this here, you guys can see it. We have identified where the buyers and the sellers are at. Buyers are at $10. Selling is around 17, I mean $14.75 since the 16. Let's see if the buyers can overcome that again this go around as price tries to go up. But currently, the environment has changed. The market is weak. I'm not looking for Cadena to go up in the long term right now, based off us breaking that ascending line. So now I'm looking for us to start this downtrend. That is why I'm going to hold this downtrend line into the market in Cadena. I'm just here to help you all out, to show you what I'm expecting. Now, it's your turn. I mean, you guys don't have to follow what I'm seeing, what I'm saying on the charts. You guys have your own mentality, your own brain. What do you think, though? I mean, are you expecting the market to break this descending line? Or are you expecting the price to continue to go lower in the market? Because if so, a lot of people who are buying Cadena today is going to be awfully upset once they see the price continue to go down because many people have told them that the price is cheaper and that you need to come in and scoop up as much as possible. And I'm telling you, we need to wait until we get more confirmation that the buying is still in control and that is not yet determined. So hit me up. Let me know. Make sure you maintain the profitability. And as always, trade different.